couldn't have written a better script for the 14-2 Jaguars' run to the Super Bowl following the 1999 season, the one that brought Miami to Altel Stadium for a divisional playoff game. After all, the Dolphins were the heritage team in the state of Florida and still had legions of fans in what had become Jaguars territory. The Jaguars were confident that they were the better team. But what unfolded on that field that afternoon was beyond anything that anyone could imagine. Hey, listen up! Hey, this is our house! We win in this stadium! Let's take it to them! Every play counts! Let's dominate! Dominate! Take the crap out of all day long! Who was the point to the board? Jack on three! One, two, three, down! Let's go! Mark Brunel's opening drive touchdown pass to Jimmy Smith gave the crowd reason to shout. Those shouts would become increasingly louder and more boastful as Aaron Beasley intercepted Dan Marino on the very next play. First down and he will throw. Mile play action goes left, intercepted by Aaron Beasley. Picked off by Beasley. And the problems persist for Dan Marino. And Mike Hollis made it a 10-0 score. Just outside the 35, so a 45-yard effort is good. Five plays later, and Altel Stadium was a sea of hysterical fans, except on one sideline where the Dolphins were in shock. But he knows he doesn't have a big play team, and Jacksonville does. Taylor skips two tackles. All right, and here we go. Bye-bye, yeah. Brock Marion chasing. Brock Marion still chasing. Gets help from Smith. Touchdown. No flags. A 90-yard run. He is so It seemed as if the fun would never end. Look at the disparity in yardage. 171 yard difference. Marino hit from the back side. Fumble the ball. Oh, Lord, Jacksonville has it. The Denson ball is live. This is still live. And finally, he rumbles toward the end zone. That's a touchdown. touchdown. Oh, geez. It was 24 0 at the end of the first quarter, 42 7 at the end of the first half. Everyone got in on the action, with Jay Fiedler matching Mark Brunel's two touchdown passes in the second half. It's a collision. It's a hand and catch. Elvis Brunel. Perfect. This is unbelievable. The automatic sprinkler system has come on the goal line. Absolutely perfect. The scoreboard read 62-7, and the history books revealed the second largest margin of victory in NFL playoff history when the game was complete. It was, and remains to this day, the most perfect game the Jaguars have ever played.